Hi, the last film I watched in 2020, um, which I enjoyed early evening on uh, New Year's Eve, was St Francis, directed by Alex Thompson and written by and starring Kelly O'Sullivan. It's the story of a diner waitress, 34 years old, going nowhere in life, who manages to get a new job as a nanny for a female couple um, looking after their child while um, they're uh, occupied by their um, their work life. And she is initially totally unqualified for the job, but over time, uh, her relationship develops with uh, the young girl and it becomes a, a light character drama with a lot of humour in it. One of the major elements is the religious nature of many of the characters that a lot of them have Catholic backgrounds and in particular uh, the main character at the beginning of the film discovers that uh, she's pregnant and decides to have an abortion um, so there is a sense that perhaps young Francis is the child that she might have had this is the relationship that she might have had if, if she had been ready and capable of uh, raising a child herself um, I found it quite a, a warm, likeable film. It was a bit of a, a rough start. Um, but after spending time with the characters, I really started to gain affection for them and warmth in my feelings towards them. Um, not an exceptional film, I would say, by any means. But Sullivan is a talent, particularly. Her, her knack for gently tugging away at characters' exteriors and exposing the difficult emotions underneath. Uh, I think that's something that should be kept note of. And her leading performance, I thought, was very fine. Um, but um, overall, it's, it's quite an insubstantial film. There's nothing especially riveting or um, bold or wildly original about it. But it's a pleasant enough film to spend an hour and a half with. Um, I didn't feel as if my time was wasted, but um, if I'd had anything particularly better to do, then maybe my feelings would be different. <laughs>